Hello everyone, it's Allie from Titan and welcome back to our channel. I am here with our last Star Wars personal break of the day. We are bringing it back to Top Star Wars The Mandalorian Season 1 tins here with this gift box for Nick from his brother Peter P for Christmas. So Merry Christmas Nick and I hope your box here from Peter gets you some great additions to your Star Wars collection. Now if you missed it earlier today, I'm going to link the video up there. We did pull a wood autograph number to 10 of Pedro Pascal. So let's see if the Mando lucky jacket here brings more Mando. And a luck with this product by going on ahead and snapping ourselves into the corner and let's get started now i think out of this product uh pedro only has one of ones so the base one of one parallel single auto uh the four printing plates and then some multi autos i haven't seen him anything less than out of ones i've only actually seen a couple printing plates surface so that'd be a crazy pull here but i mean i've done it once today already why not just ask to do it again right i mean if you don't ask the answer is always going to be no, because you never asked in the first place. But all right, here we go. Let's crack open this tin. Take out our seven packs. You are guaranteed one hit per box. Uh, costume relics are additional hits. Medallions are additional hits. But you are getting either an autograph or sketch card per box. That's kind of similar, I think, to Holocron. I think Holocron, which should be coming out next Wednesday, does have just one hit, either an autograph or sketch card. So that should be interesting. We did manage to get some more cases of that. Boss Man was calling around. We did get additional cases. So that's going to be fun. I'm excited. Checklist looks amazing. Here we go. Pack number two. Yeah, it's crazy. Masterwork just came out. And we're already into Holocron. I was almost expecting them to push it into late January or February just because obviously Masterwork came out last week. We have a Bantha Aliens and Creatures insert. But they're just going with it. I mean, Holocron was supposed to come out in September, so. At least, uh, I mean, the cards probably say 2020 on it. I'm sure Tops is like, eh, let's probably just put it out. But hopefully those cards look nice. I'm curious to see what those designs will look like. We have the client characters insert and a blue parallel. Lots of blue parallels here so far. Usually you get one to two purple parallels as well. Here's a purple. Concept art insert, purple parallel, pursuit and escape. On to pack number five. Wonder if we will get a sketch or an autograph. Looks like we have a red auto here. So those are numbered out of 99. Who is it? It is Mithral. Red autograph. Horatio Sands, number 83 of 99 here. Mithral autograph. The fish man. I remember people were like comparing all of his autographs. None of them really look the same. They're all different kinds of squiggles, which is both hilarious and kind of upsetting at the same time. But I guess that makes it unique. But we do have a red mithril autograph here, number 299. All right, finishing up the rest of that pack here. And last two here, we could still get something additional. Maybe we can even get a nice low numbered card. I feel like it's been a while since we've seen a gold parallel. We've actually never even pulled an insert printing plate. Beskar armor. To be fair though, we've only pulled one one of one from this product on the channel. We've pulled one Beskar uh, in the box for Catherine K live. Other than that, we haven't seen any one of ones. Here we go, last pack. Do have a quilt characters insert. And another purple here, Enter the Hunter. And I believe that's even card number one. Yes, purple parallel card number one. So we did get two purples here. Let's go ahead and do a quick recap. Unfortunately, no numbered cards. So the recaps on these uh, Mando tins are usually pretty quick. Well, we have our hit of the box, Mithral autograph numbered out of 99. Horatio Sands. Remember during the live streaming, I was, I was saying Horatio. And then chat was saying it's Horatio. If I'm incorrect again, definitely correct me again. I apologize. Mithril autograph there out of 99. We ended up with two purples as well. One of each of these inserts here, the aliens and creatures, we had Bantha, concept art, and tools of the bounty hunter, we had Beskar armor. And for our characters, do get a decent amount of characters per box, although that is the largest insert set. We have Shion, Kaliant, Moff Gideon, and Quill. And that will do it here for this box for Nick. Thank you so much, Peter, for letting me open up this box for Nick. Nick, I hope you enjoyed your gift. Of course, these will be packed up and shipped out later today. Uh, I'm assuming they're going to Peter's address and he'll just give it to you. 
but that was his Christmas gift to you. So I hope you enjoyed it. Love these new additions to your Star Wars collection and had a great time watching this video. Now that will do it. Like I said at the beginning of this video for our Star Wars openings for today. There are currently no more Star Wars openings scheduled at the moment. We should be getting a, another case of Masterwork in. Once we have that in stock, I will go ahead and post that in the community tab so you guys know. Uh, we do have more, of course, Mando tins available. But like I said, no more Star Wars scheduled for the time being. If you're craving more Star Wars openings, I don't have those for you at the moment. But of course, with Holocron coming out next Wednesday, supposedly, uh, like I've been saying in other videos today, until it shows up, not necessarily going to believe it because we had this issue with Star Trek Discovery last week too. It was supposed to come out last Wednesday. Didn't show up till Monday. So we'll see. But if that does come out, we will have a live several case opening. Not sure how many. But live Star Wars should be back by next Wednesday. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. That will do it here. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to go ahead and hit that like button. Any comments for me? Did I mispronounce her, uh, Mithril's name here? Go ahead and leave that in the comment section down below. And of course, if you're not yet part of the Titan Quartz family, we'd love to have you with us, so make sure you hit that subscribe button. But just one more video coming up for me today. Next up, we do have a Leaf Metal Pop Century box for Nicholas E. Once again, we did get that Al Pacino autograph earlier this week for him, so he's trying again. Make sure to come tune in to see what we get there up next. And then that'll do it for me today. But thank you so much for watching, everyone. Take care. Stay safe. Happy holidays. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.